Dave Vellante. I'm with Wikibon.org, and this is Silicon Angles, the Cube, where we extract the signal from the noise, we go into the events, we bring you the best guests that we can find, and we're here at the AWS Summit. Amazon is taking the cloud world by storm. Amazon invented the cloud in 2006. They've popularized it. Very popular, of course, with developers. Everybody knows that story. Uh, Amazon appealing to the web startups. But what's most impressive is the degree to which Amazon is beginning to enter the enterprise markets. I'm here with my co-host, Jeff Frick. And Jeff, we heard Andy Jassy this morning just laying out the sort of marketing messaging and progress and strategies of AWS. One of the things that was most impressive was the pace at which they put forth innovations, we talked about that earlier, but also the pace at which they proactively reduce prices. Um, that's different than what you'd see in the normal sort of enterprise space. Talk about that a little bit. Yeah, again, I, th I think it really speaks to their strategy to lock up the customer. It's really a lifetime value of the customer and making sure that they don't have a really an opportunity or a reason to go anywhere else. So, as we discussed a little bit earlier, they leverage you know, kind of the pure hardware economics of, of decreasing uh, computing power, decreasing storage, decreasing bandwidth, but then they also get all the benefits of scale. And I think what's in one of the interesting things that Andy talked about in kind of his six key messages was that it's actually cheaper to rent from them because of the scale than it is to buy yourself. And I know that's a pretty common knock between kind of a, a build or buy um, kind of process you go through and usually you would think renting at some scale becomes less economical than if you just did it yourself. But because their scale is so massive, because of the flexibility that you can bring uh, computing resources to bear based on what you're trying to accomplish, really kind of breaks down the uh, the, the old age-old thought that you know at scale we need to do it ourselves. Well, and, and that's the premise. Um, I think, and uh, let's let's break down a little bit about that that analysis and, and Andy's uh, keynote. So he put forth some data from IDC which showed that uh, the Amazon cloud is cheaper than the. Uh, uh, a, a so-called private cloud or an in-house, on-premise uh, installation. You know, I, I, certainly there's, it's, it's a, it's an, it depends, right? It really right, depends on right. the workload. This, there's somewhat of an apples to oranges going on here. I mean, the types of workloads that are going down in the AWS cloud, granted, he's right in that they're running Oracle, they're running SAP, but the real mission critical workloads, what he calls mission critical aren't the same as what you know, city would call mission critical. Right, right. So to replicate that level of mission criticality uh, would probably and almost most certainly be more expensive rental versus owning. The real Achilles heel of, of, of any cloud, not just Amazon cloud, really is getting data out, uh, moving data, right? Amazon's going to charge you not to get data in, they're going to charge you to store it there, to exercise, you know, compute, uh, and, and then, but they're also going to charge you if you want to take it out. That's expensive, the bandwidth costs and the extrication costs are expensive. Uh, the other issue with cloud, again, is data movement. It takes a long time to move a terabyte, yes, let alone yeah. multiple terabytes. So those are sort of the two sort of Achilles heels of, of, of cloud, but that's not specific to Amazon's cloud, that's any cloud. Yeah. So we've got a great lineup today. Um, Let's see, we've got Ariel Kelman coming on, uh, and I believe he's in the house. So we're going to take a quick break, quick break right now. We'll be right back with Ariel Kelman, who's the head of marketing at AWS. Keep it right there, this is theCUBE. We'll be right back. <laughs> 